You know, I'll fully uh, understand if you say, so, what am I looking at? Yeah, that's the whole thing. Um, first of all, excuses for standing here is because I came up with the idea, oh, I better film that thing. And I was here anyway, whatever. I didn't feel like walking closer. So you see that yellow, that, um, that little bit of yellow. I was looking out at the water and I thought, what kind of boat is this? And as the boat came in, I noticed this yellow cylinder, uh, sort of well-machined cylinder, and it's uh, surrounded by all kinds of silvery things, sort of discs, uh, polished, I don't know if, what kind of metal it is. And I have no idea what it is. So that's what I'm looking at, and you're just, um, I'm sorry, suffering because <laughs> I was too lazy to get really close up and give you a, a real detailed look. So. We're, because it's at this distance, we can simply assume the reason I need to keep this distance is that it's actually um, uh, some alien object that has just landed. <laughs> it just happened to land on a boat. And the, uh, what do you call it, the captain of the boat, in absolute shock, thought, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to take that thing to Amsterdam. Why? Because it's only the people in Amsterdam who have the ability to, to accept oddity as if it's normal. So then there's this yellow thing. And I will do research. I, I'm not going to do it now, and I'm not going to do it tomorrow or the day after, but somewhere at some point I'm going to try and understand what that object is. Now, having said that, I find, I can't, since I can't tell you more about the object other than my um, dubious claim that it is actually an alien uh, uh, craft that spotted a ship, uh, that landed on the ship, which had a captain, and the captain was brave enough to not panic and decide to take it to Amsterdam, where it would become part of our city, which may or may not be the truth. Um, other than that, I, I really have nothing else to say, except I do like the yellow. I find it um, a very pleasant kind of yellow, as it, does, as it disappears off. It's, um, it's a kind of yellow that, I, that makes me think of Meccano, if that says anything to anybody. Anyway, with that uh, in mind, the thoughts of Meccano, thoughts of possible alien activity in Amsterdam, I think we can uh, just watch the boat disappear in peace and calm and uh, no need to panic whatsoever. <laughs>